Hello, YouTube viewers and PlayStation Network members and people that basically uh, play what I'm about to explain. Um, John and Loving Hot here. Um, I just want to discuss something that I'm going to basically show you a picture of. It was really weird and very bizarre. It I noticed. Okay. <clears throat> now I now let me just take the headphones off. Um, now when I was on. When I was playing PlayStation on Sunday the 6th before Labor Day, um, I went on to play, yeah, like, I, like I was playing this game, Grand Theft Auto 5, I was playing the online, and to my surprise, holy shit, the, yeah, I mean, look, look at this picture. This is one of the weirdest things that would ever come across, yeah, that you would probably never actually see anywhere else in Grand Theft Auto Online series. Um, when I put, like now, okay, uh, I, I want to point out to Mars Girl that this is what I was talking about. Um, and of course, I'm going to send you this picture um, on your PlayStation Network uh, thing, uh, Mars Girl. Hopefully, you go on PlayStation 3 or Vita or 4 or whatever, and you can check this out. I, I, I found this to be very annoying but at the same time it's like hilarious um, because okay if you live near this uh, building um, where this took place on Sunday yeah you know, like I think they yeah you know, like I think grandpa yeah you know, like I think Rockstar online had a problem with this or something that okay let me just bring my picture here uh, this like this this right here is a windmill. Yeah, that, yeah, that you would actually find somewhere further out on, uh, um, in the game, like in the um, outskirts, I should say. Uh, and th yeah, this was blocking the uh, the garage where you park your cars. That's what I meant by it was in front of the place where you put your cars in the game, like on the online mode. And not only was it causing blockage, um, blockage um, near the garage where you can put a car in, it was causing a lot of destruction in its in its range of path. The uh, yeah, the fan yeah. Okay, let me move this again here. The fan blades uh, that you can see uh, right here and over here, they were going around and around and around and around and around and around. And around. And it caused a lot of chaos in that area, like cars and people. You know, like I mean, hell, there was like people walking by it, like whoosh, whoa! They went flying. It was like Team Rocket blasting off again. Um, and the vehicles that were driving by it, the fan blades would just spin them around. You spin me right now. Yeah, like, it was spinning around. But the one thing though, the blades, the propeller blades. Like, as you can basically see, let me just move my thing here. The the propeller blades here that went around in the circle, clockwise or counterclockwise, I don't remember. Um, they went around, and I was, like, standing near the door when I came out. I was like, oh, shit. Now, here's something that's even funnier. If you were inside the apartment when this was taking over, you know, taking, taking place... You can actually see the action on your surveillance camera if you were in the building. And you also see, yeah, like, if you went on, like, near the window where the telescope is and look, like, down outside the window, you're like, Wow, there's a, there's a windmill shadow, and I don't think there's a, yeah, like, I don't think they put a windmill on top of the building. So, it's, like, on the ground level, but you were actually able to see a shadow. Luckily for me, I actually got this um, off of um, the Grand Theft Auto Society website, um, which I, yeah, I got a which one, that's why it's J11, yeah, the, yeah, it was supposed to be the J11s of New York City or something. But, you know, enough, enough of that, but, you know, um, this was like the weirdest, bizarrest thing you would ever see in Grand Theft Auto 5 online. And I thought it was like really weird and at the same time annoying. I, I was like, okay, my maybe my game screwed up. And I, okay, they think yeah, the problem is clear already now. I went back on a few days later, and it's all perfectly hunky dory. 
Um, so this is like the weirdest thing I've ever seen um, um, on Grand Theft Auto. So, you know, this is the weirdest shit. Um, so, without no further ado, I'm going to sign, uh, yeah, God, that's all I have to say um, about about this. this yeah. But this is what I was talking about, Mars Girl, uh, Caitlin, Caitlin uh, Dick, Dixon, or, yeah, I'm going to just call you Mars Girl, or Katie, or Kate, Kathy, or whatever, I don't know. Um, but this is what I was talking about in, yeah, like in the chat, when, yeah, like when you were streaming the game, and I was telling you about it, yeah, like, I can't quite like really spell certain words. Uh, like I'm lost in tr translation. So until next time, YouTube viewers and PlayStation Network members, if you see any of this, take pictures, post it on YouTube. This is the weirdest shit anybody's got to see. So so until next time, peace out. See you on you know, like on Grand Theft Auto Online and on PlayStation Network. And if you want to be friend me on PlayStation Network, okay, yeah, like um, that's good. Till next time, peace out. Bye.